Hello, here I'm going to show you how to put multiple MailChimp forms to sign up for your email list on one page of your WordPress website. So here you can see I have a form on the right hand side of the sidebar, that's our widgetized form, but I also have these forms here, one, two, three, on the same page. Now this is a form that you can subscribe to in any of these places. MailChimp tell you that you can't do this, you can only have one form on a page, but you can have multiple forms if you put them within iframes. And to do that is very easy. So you go into your MailChimp dashboard after having signed up for MailChimp and created a list. And in the list that you have created, there is a section here, Forms, that's very important. So not only can you specify the sign-up form, but also you can customise the opt-in confirmation email as well as the final welcome email. And if you are giving an incentive gift, like an e-book, um, you can put the link in that final welcome email. But we're doing the form at the moment, and you can customise it here. For example, you can take away the first name if you wanted to and you can design it. But I prefer to go to For Your Website and click Sign Up Form Embed Code. And here you can specify what you want in the form and take the code. So for example, you might not want this Join Our Mailing List header here, so you can get rid of that. You can also include all fields which brings in the first name which we specified on the earlier form. You can get rid of the required field notice, get rid of interest groups. You can just select that radio button, I'm a pro, give it to me with no CSS at all, and then copy all that code there. Now you want to put that code into a HTML document. Here's one I did earlier. Paste it in. However, I do find that um, iframes come in without any style. So here's a bit of style that I've set up earlier. You don't have to do this, but it just stars up the form nicely for you. So you can save that as an HTML document, call it form.html, and then upload that to your server. Now, now you need to call that HTML document as an iframe within the page you want the forms in. And here is how I've done that. So, here is the iframe source. I'll just zoom in. And there is the path to the HTML document that I've just told you how to create. And there you also have um, width and height values as well as a frame border value. Inside the iframe tag is what people will see who can't view iframes in their browsers. So what you put there is a link to the form on the MailChimp website. And I'll show you how you get that. You have to go back to the create form and there is the link to the form. So people can just actually go to the form outside of your website and they can sign up there and they're signed up to the list the same as they, if they'd signed up on your website. Um, but that's something to do for the people who don't have the iframes. So there it is. Um, as you can see I put that in again there and once more there so in the page you have the three forms or as many as you like and you can sign into them uh, using a 
email address and hopefully you get the success mes message or the failure messages come in below them. Sometimes you do get uh, with MailChimp you do find that the success and failure messages do come up into this new window but either way it works. Um, th this is the way of getting multiple MailChimp sign up forms onto your website. So I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you very much. Goodbye.